What's the deal with tonsils, you ask? Well, have you heard the one about the tonsil who went to a party? He had a swell time until he got inflamed with passion. So let's dive into the world of these intriguing little lumps in your throat. Buckle up, it's going to be a throaty ride. Picture this, you're a germ having a blast partying in the mouth. Suddenly you're ambushed by what? The tonsils. These small soft tissue structures are the body's first line of defense against airborne or ingested pathogens. They're like the bouncers of your immune system stationed at the back of your throat, ready to tackle any troublemakers that try to sneak in. So how do they work? Well, when foreign particles enter your mouth, the tonsils spring into action. They produce white blood cells, the body's soldiers that attack and destroy these invaders. It's a full-on germ warfare happening right in your mouth. But it's not just about fighting off intruders. Tonsils also help in the production of antibodies, the body's special forces trained to recognize and neutralize specific pathogens. So they're not just bouncers, they're also the strategists of your immune system. That's right, folks. Your tonsils are the unsung heroes tirelessly working to protect you from unwanted invaders. But what happens when these defenders face an attack? Sometimes even the best defenses falter. Your tonsils can get overwhelmed by the germs and become infected, leading to a condition called tonsillitis. Picture this, your usually diligent tonsils, those guardians of your throat, now under siege by an army of microscopic invaders. The battle's impact? A sore throat that feels like you've swallowed a porcupine, difficulty swallowing that rivals the trials of a sword swallower, and a fever that would make a sauna feel like the Arctic. And let's not forget the cherry on top swollen glands and that charmingly hoarse voice. It's like having a party in your throat, but the guests are all uninvited. But hey, at least now when you say you're feeling under the weather, you'll have the tonsillitis badge to show for it. So now that your tonsils are in a tight spot, what's next? Fear not, for there are several treatment options to come to their rescue. From rest and hydration to antibiotics and even surgery, there's an arsenal of weapons to combat tonsillitis. While some folks find solace in simple home remedies, others may require a prescription or two. And for the more severe cases, a tonsillectomy might be the best course of action. It's all about understanding your body and responding accordingly. Remember, your tonsils are the unsung heroes of your immune system. So there, knowledge seekers, hit the like, share and subscribe buttons to join our quest for wisdom and wit. See you soon, smarty pants.